Well, this is perfect weather for snowmobilers to hit the trails across western New York. You know, the past two winters have been tough for the local snowmobile industry. Little snow made for bad trail conditions, practically shutting down business. But not this year. Let's hit the trails now with 7 Eyewitness News reporter Josh Bazan. As long as we have snow, it's, it's all about the snowmobiles. Michelle Armstrong owns Pioneer Motorsport on Olean Road in Chafee. With a good bit of snow outside, business inside is doing pretty well. Snowmobilers are gearing up for the season ahead. They're going to get their oils, their spare belts, maybe some new clothing, new gloves, heat advisors for their helmets. Um, and they're, they're going to be ready to take off. But the past two winters weren't so good for the snowmobile business in western New York. Winters have been a little sparse the last couple of years. There's no way this snow can melt before the snowmobile trails open. And you know what? It did. Unfortunately, the snow has not been a given year after year, but um, they're ready to get moving again this year and it's a very optimistic start. Kyle Armstrong and the team at Pioneer are looking forward to the start of the season. A public trail passes right by the shop and that can be a huge boost to business. The snow helps everything, like I said. They stop, they need a balaclava, they need a spark plug oil, maybe they need, maybe something broke on their snowmobile and they need somebody to look at it right away. So we get a lot of traffic. In a day, somebody might be able to hit a couple power sports dealers um, looking for the newest clothing. Um, maybe they broke down, maybe they need a spare belt, um, and it just it keeps the economy going. There is definitely some optimism. This is going to be a long and snowy snowmobile season. The trails open up for snowmobilers on December 20th. In Chafee, Josh Bazan, 7 Eyewitness News.